Carnival Vista is approaching Malta. The ship has traveled 1,250 miles to cross the Mediterranean and reach Valletta, capital of this small island nation. Valletta's medieval harbor was never designed to host an enormous cruise ship. Speed is reducing 5.7. This morning, Vista needs to make a controlled maneuver to squeeze alongside the dock. We have to make sure that we do keep our eyes on our uh, electronics, but also our visual. That's why we have lookout offices on, the, on each end of the vessel. Uh, they make sure that we have a good clearance with our uh, bow and stern. One four zero clear. With a local pilot's guidance, Captain Lubrano must navigate Vista through the narrow harbor entrance and make not one, but two sharp turns to port with very little clearance off the sides and stern. There are uh, boys, uh, they indicated the shallow waters on the side, so we need to make sure that we always within those boys, not exceeding, not going off the channel center. But once the ship is in the harbor, it's still not over. Now, the bridge team must turn the 1,055-foot-long ship around with only 200 feet off either end to come alongside the pier. Though the charts say there's space, it doesn't look like much. We have an area, uh, a turning basin, where we're gonna turn the ship around. We'll be turning uh, anti-clockwise, bow to port. Slowly, Vista begins to make a full turn. Beneath the stern, its two propeller units rotate to pivot the ship. Meanwhile, at the bow, three thrusters join in to complete the maneuver. Pushing the bow a little bit to port. Yes. We should have a clearance of the, the starboard. Turning well, prediction is good. Prediction is good. Then we can move it slightly. Yeah, 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 yeah. OK. We are stopped. After 45 minutes of tense maneuvers, the ship is clear. 